Hello, my lovelies. I've got nothing in my hands. Nothing in my hands. It's all down there. <laughs> it's all down there. Now, before I start this bag, this bag, these bags, don't forget, don't forget, I still have these two little bags over here of my Primark goodies to try on. We have got some tan pants, some seamless tanned pants that I'm trying on on my OnlyFans free. I've got some white leggings, which would be tried on on YouTube and OnlyFans. And then in the other bag is the pink bikini that I tried on the other day, you know, a size 16 top, where Mr. Producer had to rush out and get a size 14 and 18 and the bottoms. Yes. So they will all do try on videos with those as well. But before we finish those, we thought we'd go back to Primark. <laughs> but there was a reason. I needed to get something. I did. I, I needed to get this. In fact, I'll show you this first because I, I love it. Uh, I absolutely love it. So there's a story about a baby. <laughs> a baby that I really liked her about. Yes. So I saw this in my local Primark. I did. And, but I'd seen one in Asda that I liked as well. So I wasn't sure. I knew I liked this one, but I wasn't 100% sure. So a couple of days later, we went back to Asda to look at the other bag. Didn't like it. Or it, it didn't look the same one as what I first saw. Went on to George online and it was the same one that I'd seen before. So we went back to Primark and it wasn't there anymore. It wasn't in my local one anymore. I was very, very upset. I was. So then Mr. Producer came up with an idea. Let's go to Meadow Hall. Was it my idea, was it? Okay. My idea. Whatever. I got my bag though. I got my bag. So we went to one section that we thought it'd be in the travel section. And it wasn't there. And I wasn't happy again. I was really crying. And then we drowned all this way for nothing. And then I asked the lady and she went, oh, come and look in the bag section. And I'm like, why didn't I think of that? I didn't think of that at all. And here it was. And I said to her, I know we can't hug, but social distance hug. <laughs> she couldn't stop laughing. So here it is. Here is my beautiful bag. Now, it was £18, which is not bad for a proper Minnie Mouse duffel bag, is it? It's got two compartments at the front, which unzip, which is full of paper at the moment because I didn't take that out. But if you look at the zippers, they are Mickey Mouse heads. Two of those and then you've got the tag you've got a long strap to pull over your shoulder two handles and then inside it's very big in here it's a very big bag inside with a zip on the side there as well which is awesome but yeah i absolutely j'adore the bag it is amazing it is but we did buy more than just the bag. We did. So then we put the bag there. We bought a set. <laughs> now it would be rude to break the set up. So we got the luggage. We got the luggage. And then we got the handbag. Uh, but it was a three set. It's three sets. So you've got a Minnie Mouse coin purse. Which is awesome. Awesome. You've got a little mini bag. And then a bigger bag. So three of them. And they were £14. £14 for three bags. What? And with this one, I've just noticed with the coin purse, to take it off, it's actually attached. Right? You take it off here, look. Detach it from the bag. Oh, that's why it's not coming off. Could I have my cutter a minute, please? Is it there? I did it. I did it. So it detaches from the bag look. And you can either hook it onto another bag, or you can hook it onto a bum belt, or what you could do, hook it onto your jeans if you wanted. Hook it back there, and you could carry it with two fingers look, like that. Did, did, it, did it. Well, it was in with a set of 14 pounds. that out and you can fit some coins in there not many you can't fit your bank card in there but you can fit a few coins in there so yeah put them 
I don't think your bank card would fit in there, would it? Would it be in circle? Would it fit? Oh well. Yeah, I just think they're cool. So this one again is just a clutch bag. It's, well, actually, if you wanted to be really clever, it doesn't have to be just a clutch bag. I can get it off this bag, she says. I can't get it off. <laughs> metal bar is bigger than the gap can you help please you're stronger than me Ooh, falling for me now falling for you <laughs> this is gonna faff for that now but you could also if you wanted to put this on to the duffel bag the little coin purse I hurt my finger doing it. Ah, oh, there we go. Thank you. So what I was going to say, why did you need to rudely throw that at me? Right, so. This metal one. Oh, I do need my cotton. No, I don't. So the metal one then clips back onto here. It's a lot easier to put back on than to take off. <laughs> Got him? It was crowded, was it? There. Yeah. Made it into a little clutch purse. Okay, so there's that one. And then you've got your long strap for your bigger bag. So they all become functioning bags on their own right. So that's not bad for £14. What next did we buy in the set, Mr. Producer? Mr. Producer found these to, um, I like it when you throw things at me that I've just bought. It's cool. So Mr. Producer found these and I was like, do I have to? And he's like, yes. So these are scrunchies. Two sets. The scrunchies to make into pigtails to match the bags because if you look at this one that's got the mini mouse pattern on the same as the bag then you've got the gold to match the shoes and then the ears to match that bag did you not know that and there were two pounds for three now miss producer wants them in pigtails you know so yes they were his idea anything else in that set So we go. Right, we also had little miss with us. And I said to her, you can buy what you want. Just go shopping. Because she, she hasn't been clothes shopping in oh a good year and a half. Yes. So she went clothes shopping and accessory shopping and shoe shopping. <laughs> she did but this is one of the accessories that she got now she said that we could share this i have yet to have this but he's so adorable he's adorable and he's soft and cuddly and you can literally go to sleep on it it's so soft it's like a fleecy so soft so soft you can take the cushion out as well. It's got a zipper on the back. That was £8, that was. Which I didn't think was too bad for that size of pillow. And it's stitch, you know? Okay, next. Do you want to just pass bags up now instead of throwing things out there? Because there's quite a lot left in the other bags. Right, so this is, again, little Mrs. clothes. I'll show you what we got here. Oh, that's mine. I got myself that. It's a Minnie Mouse one. Minnie Mouse. And it had gone down to a pound. It's a scarf to go in your hair. I thought it was pretty. It's not really the same colours as the bags, but it doesn't really matter, does it? So we carried on with the stitch theme. And she got some new pyjamas at £9, which are size 10 to 11. They don't do them in adult sizes. I'm not happy. 
um, little miss is growing up unfortunately she's growing up so we got some crop tops and some briefs to match boy shorts or they're called boxers but the beauty of it is it's all eco-friendly they are all organic cotton so it's softer for her as well but yes we got them to match we do what else did we get we got some more pajamas we did we got another set of pajamas now these were a little bit too big for it these are size 13 to 14 but i don't sound funny they are gorgeous and they should have been seven pound but they've gone down to three pound i'm sorry i'm not passing up proper Minnie mouse pajamas for three pound in the sale no so they went in the basket we then found some more bargains we got a pink panther t-shirt Dun 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 for three pound should have been six pound fifty, you know. We got oh this one wasn't cheap. BT twenty one. She says she watches those on YouTube. So she watches those on YouTube. So that one was seven pound. That one was. So yes, we got oh yeah, and she got of course of course she got a head wig. A head wig one. That one was seven pound as well, but he's literally look and he changes. Does he change? No, he just goes up and down. The sequins do. So yes, she got a head wig. And then we got some blue jeggings to match mine. They were four pound fifty. They were, and then we got some grey leggings because what she was trying to do was make sets up with the t-shirts. They were two pound. You could tell she was shopping with Mr. Producer. Got to make a setup. And then she picked herself some shorts. Now I'm not sold on these shorts because they're very much. We you can't. We can. We did it in the shop, Adele. Why can't we do it? Now, does that mean that she's growing up? <laughs> but they're twelve to thirteen. Because the denim, I didn't want them to be tight on a waist. And you can't try anything on at pri in Primark at the moment. You can in yours. You can in yours clothing because I have made the video as well. That's gonna my only fans. But you couldn't in Primark. There wasn't even any seats. You couldn't even sit down anywhere in Primark. It was so hot. It was unbelievable how hot it was. So they were the clothes that she picked. There's more. And then we always go to the shoe section. Now what I like about the shoe section shoe section shoe 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 section shoe section i can't say the words shoe section there's something else in there we got these look we got mini mouse five pound and glittery boots five pound both in a size two how many sound funny i want a pair of them it's not fair they don't do these in adult sizes Why? But then my mum's a size four and she's like, did you get me any? Did you get me any that wasn't a size four? Because normally she can shop in kids section for shoes, my mum can. But yeah, for five pound though, should have been 14 pound. And the Minnie Mouse one should have been 10 pound. And she loves them. She says she's going to wear them as normal shoes. <laughs> but they're just so fluffy. And that, that's got a bubble bubble on it. But yeah, that was her, her whole that she bought i think she picked some nice things functionality things as well which is really really good i was pleased when she picked the functionality things the only splurge that she did was the cushion the rest of it is perfect for her yes now there is something else in this bag i bought some myself for something for myself as well as the bags and the scrunchies and that stuff i have wanted some airpods for a long time now i have now they're a bit out of my price range. They are. Can't do anything about that. They're out of my price range. I don't get them. Simple as that. I'd rather spend money on the kids than buy myself some AirPods, you know. So we went, when we went to Primark, I found them. £15. And they are true wireless earbuds. I don't know if they're any good. I have no idea if they're any good. It doesn't say if they go with iPhones or not. But for £15... I can try it out so i'm going to do a video on these uh, they are wireless range of 25 meters eight hours of playtime, rechargeable carry case and automatic pairing 
So hopefully, you would think that they would go with an iPhone and not have to say it because everybody has an iPhone. 90% of them, everybody has an iPhone. Yeah, that um, my charging plate that's on my desk is Primark, five pound, and that was really good. So fingers crossed, I've just saved myself a lot of money. <laughs> um, how much are they? Then are they one hundred and sixty or hundred? One hundred and sixty, I think the ones that we picked. So I've saved myself one hundred and forty-five pound. Sure, I can buy luggage. <laughs> yes. So they were. That was my my purchases. Now Mr. Producer's purchases. You know, Mr. Producer has to have his purchases. He's got another bag full. And it's all bikinis. <laughs> we got a white one. So I've got a size 16 and a size 18 in white ones. Now we've got a 16 and an 18 in the white. And he did a 14. Bye then. <laughs> so yeah, that's those ones. Of course, I will be doing try-on videos for them on here and my OnlyFans. So you can, you'll tell the difference. And then we got a 16 in the black as well. And then because we found the tanned pants in our local ones, we found some white ones. So we haven't even tried the tanned ones on yet. And Miss Medusa's already found white ones to try on. So that's a lot of pants trying on over on my OnlyFans free because we won't be able to try these on on YouTube. We'll be able to stand there and go, oh, aren't they pretty? But we won't be able to try them on. And he got the thong version as well. Dunk them. We're going to try these on on YouTube. <laughs> we'll see about that one. Miss Vinny's like on the small channels. We'll see. But yes, keep an eye out for my OnlyFans free content. And the best way to do that is either come and sign up for completely free or head over to my Twitter where all the links are for my YouTube and my OnlyFans. That's it. That is all my Primark bags. Done. Good. So don't forget to like it for me. Subscribe. Find me on my Twitter and my Instagram, UK, Coco Scope, UK, and then my OnlyFans, the freebie, the $10 and the naughty one. Don't forget about TikTok. There's three of them. So make sure you go and check them out. Now, if you are liking and subscribing here on YouTube, don't forget to come back and resubscribe because YouTube are unsubscribing my subscribers. They are hiding comments. They are not letting me interact. They're not letting you guys interact. They are removing likes. They are changing thumbnails. They're doing everything that they can to keep my channels down. Now, I don't mean to sound funny. All of this lot cost me £116. All of it. I show you guys the budgets. I show you the budget side of, well, the middle size budget side of things. I don't go and spend tens and thousands of pounds on things because I don't have it. I show you the normal everyday things. This is the point of me. I like to show you my life and my life's Primark. <laughs> it is. So make sure you come and check it out. And I love you all. And I'll see you all soon. Oh, the next thing we're doing is what we bought from Legoland, isn't it? I got a bag of stuff from Legoland, so we'll show you that on the next chat on the next video. Yes, it might not be on this channel, it might be on one of my other channels. So keep an eye out or find me on my Twitter where the link will be. Because I have over 20 channels here on YouTube. So keep an eye out. I love you all.